How often will we be doing it once we finally do it? Is five days a week too much? Five days? It's not too much. My piece is going to be hurting. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Hey, my name is Randy. I'm Tasia. I'm Kira Hillman. And uh, I am uh, Sean Johnner. How long have you been together? About two months. We've been talking for about three months, and we made it official about a few weeks ago. Mm -hmm. So brand new. <laughs> what do you call each other? Are you like, this is my boo? BB. Strawberry Skittle. Snack. Yeah. Do you two love each other? Yes. Madly in Madly. love. <laughs> love is a big word. I think we're trying to get there, um, but we really like each other now. Yeah. <laughs> we're not having sex because we are just not ready. Mm -hmm. um, I've had a lot of traumatic experience with like getting naked before, and I've never had sex. Are you a virgin? Yes. Yeah. Are you also a virgin or have Yes, you... I'm a virgin as well. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, no. I it's... get to teach him everything. <laughs> uh, we literally are doing it for God, I would say. I think we're waiting because we want to have a real connection with each other. We don't want it to be based off of, like, lust. Is it wedding day, that's when it's possible, or could it happen before? I think we're trying to wait for that. Yeah. We're trying. <laughs> but we'll probably do it before we're married. Probably, yeah. Uh, probably. Probably. <laughs> oh my goodness, they're getting straight into it. <laughs> What's the closest we've come to having sex? <laughs> we definitely kiss a lot and just like sleepovers and stuff, but. We just have a sleepover like once or twice a week, so. Probably one time in the car. Yes. When we were just like, oh my God, I love you so much. Yeah, no, that was absurdly we were, close. We were trauma bonding, <laughs> yeah. honestly. Uh -huh. And we were just talking about our bad experiences with other people, realizing that we would never want to hurt each other. Yes. It was just a major moment of connection. And he was like, Oh my gosh, I know we don't want to do it in the car <laughs> for the first time. Definitely had to really hold each other accountable, I would say. Yeah. We gotta wait. Who's usually the one that stops it? Me. <laughs> I feel like a man's supposed to lead. Yeah, he says that. I remember I was crying a lot, she was not. Mm -hmm. And then at one point we were just holding each other close and then I just gave her a kiss. And then I was like, wow, this is great. Did you get a boner? I don't remember, maybe? I, I mean- I'm pretty sure you did. I, I think might I have. felt it. I mean, it makes sense if I did. I don't quite remember all the boners <laughs> I get. What's the most sexual thing we can do that doesn't count as sex? Wanna try it? I'm not gonna answer it. You can try it. I don't know, actually. Oh, you're so innocent. Mm. Can I answer it? Probably it would be him sliding his between my thighs. Why'd you call it <laughs> It's like Christian sex, cause <laughs> oh, it's not going in. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah. What's your kink? Kink? Yes. I don't really have one yet. Maybe one day you'll find out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like being dominated. Mm. Like, I want you to tie up my hands and tell me to be a good girl. No. I like being thrown up against a wall because it shows me, like, you just can't hold back anymore. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> How do you feel about that? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Have you had sex before? If yeah, I've been in a relationship before. I feel like that's why. A big reason why I want to wait, too, is because I feel like I want to make a bit better connection than based off of that. Some people would be like, well, you've already had sex. Why wait with the next person? As like Christians, we can do better, and I think that's why um, we want to wait. You think I've had sex before? Yeah, I know you have. <laughs> <laughs> I know you haven't had sex before, but uh, what other things have you done like that? Yeah, I've made out in a few cars. Mm -hmm. I have had my yes zone touched before. Mm. Most of the time it just hurt though. Ouch. Yeah. I don't think it'll be like that when we do it though. Okay, yeah, no. Cause I can just tell you what to do. Absolutely, I mean- It's so nice working with a <laughs> blank canvas. <laughs> like I can just draw whatever I want. Just, He's my little picture. I mean, besides like an area like that, that just sounds like it hurt. Yeah, yeah. you gotta be gentle. Absolutely. How often do you touch yourself? 
Oh, fun. Uh, well. Mm, oh, boy. <laughs> I just don't. What, you want like an average? Yeah, that... like, like an average. Oh, gosh. Three, four times a week, I guess. Ooh. Yeah? How often do you uh, do that? Since we've been fooling around, never unless it's with you. <laughs> oh, wow. The thing on my end as well is that, like, I'm, I'm just toning that down a little bit, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, I know, like, um... He wants to be hard <laughs> for, like, longer. Yeah. Yeah. That's a thing. Yeah. Uh-huh. What's off limit the first time? I'm about to take a shot with that one. He said nothing's off limits. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. There is... <laughs> What's off limits? Don't peg me. <laughs> uh, what about yeah. for you though? Don't choke me. That's scary. It is scary. I don't know how some guys are into that. Like just go like, oh yeah, you like that? You just, like, I want to make sure she could still breathe. How often will we be doing it once we finally do it? Is five days a week too much? Five days a week. Got approved. It's not too much. My piece is going to be hurting. <laughs> What would be the consequences of us having sex now? You've had your own trauma with all that, and I wouldn't want to have you go through all that again. <sighs> we could have a kid when we're not ready to have a kid. God could punish us and not give us, like, the strongest relationship that we want to have. Mm -hmm. We just wouldn't be as, like, emotionally, like, connected as we want to be. We would want to make sure that we're, like, we really like each other for who who each other is and not just because like we have that like physical like connection so those are three big consequences and that's why i don't want to do it what would we do if we got pregnant i'm really not ready for a kid yet yeah i wouldn't want to go through childbirth to give it up for adoption so if i found out like really early I would probably just take the pill that like deletes that. Mm -hmm. That's understandably what we'd have to do, and that's mm -hmm. okay. If I got pregnant, what would we do? I don't know what you would do. We've but talked about this. I would, <laughs> if I'm man enough to be inside of you, I'm man enough to you know take care of this yeah, child I, as well too. If, yeah. yeah, I feel like if it happened, like I would keep my baby, so. Yeah. <laughs> right, as of now, we would try to be together and take care of it and exactly. figure it out. Last All one. Right. All right, got this. Do you think I'm the one? Yes. 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 I think you're the one too. Undoubtedly. Like, who else am I gonna do Legos with? Absolutely. Or make up fake gossip with? Absolutely. He's my best friend. Do you think I'm the one? <laughs> yes, I think that you have all the qualities that I've been looking for. Mm -hmm. So I'm excited to see what the future holds for us. Do you think I'm the one? I do think you're the one for me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> if you were to put a timeline on it, when do you think it would happen? Maybe like a year, probably after you moved out, because I would prefer not to do it in your childhood bed. Yeah, <laughs> I would prefer not to do that with uh, Wario watching us, thank you. Yeah, yeah. he's got a Wario poster in his I, room. I do. <laughs> That's why you turn the lights off, isn't it? I mean, yeah, a little bit. 